Hey everyone, my name is Relinda Ruth and I'm the Director of Educational Resources and OER Specialist at UA Cosatot. Uh, I've been getting a few phone calls about trouble logging into Blackboard. Uh, one of the things we recommend is clearing your cache and a lot of you are asking me, well, what does that mean? So I wanted to show you real quick. It's, it's so simple to do and it may make things run better. So a lot of you are using Chrome. So you can see I have the Chrome open right here and I've got a few tabs at the top. Uh, but all you need to really know is to go up to the right corner and when you click on that, you've got some choices here. So if you'll go down to where it says more tools and then right here it says clear browsing data. So if you click on that, this is the box that's going to pop up. So where it says time range. You can drop that down and pick the time range. Uh, you probably, especially if you've never done this, you'll probably want to do all time, uh, but that's up to you. And you may not want to clear your browsing history necessarily. Uh, you may want to take the check mark off of that uh, because you can see what it does. It's going to clear all your history. And if you do have some login saved, uh, you would have to re-enter those. Uh, but this probably cookies you want to get rid of and cached images and files. And when you have those selected, you can just click on clear data and it's going to do that for you and you'll be all set. And a lot of times that will fix your problem instantly. So that's how you clear your cache in Chrome. Uh, let's take a look at Firefox. If you're using Firefox, uh, this is what the browser will look like. So all you need to do is right up here, you see these little marks, click on that and go down to where it says history. And you've got clear recent history. And again, you get a little box popping up. So time range to clear, that's up to you. Like I said, with, with uh, Chrome, if you've never done this, you'll probably want to go ahead and do everything. Now, it's worded a little differently here, uh, but same concept. Uh, this would clear all your download history, all your browsing. But over here, you have your cookies and your cache. I would recommend clearing those. And you may want to save these. If, if you leave the check there, it, all it means is it's clearing everything out and you'll have to re-enter any saved passwords, which is probably not a good idea to do anyway, but a lot of us do that. Um, so when you have these two for sure checked, then you just click on clear now. And then you may want to restart and then try logging into Blackboard again or whatever you're having trouble with.